How to get good grades in college essay. What is an essay? An essay is a piece of writing that convinces something or informs a reader about a particular subject. Your essay must include essential sections logically to inform a reader or convince them. An excellent essay should include an introduction, body, and conclusion. An introduction is a section that grabs the reader's attention, the body gives the essay's main points, while the conclusion has the summary. All these sections have a unique format you should follow to write a good essay. Examples of essays you will write in college include college admission, persuasive, argumentative, definition, explanatory, process essays, etc. How to get good grades in college essays You should apply the following techniques to write excellent essays and get quality grades. 1. Study techniques. 2. Writing techniques. Study techniques. This category groups all the hacks you should apply to learn and acquire skills for writing great essays. Attend all the lessons, try your best to attend all classes, and participate fully. Ask and answer question to acquire more knowledge and clarify some concepts. This technique ensures you don't have any knowledge gaps, and thus you can handle any tests, including essays. Stay organized to achieve better grades in your essay, you should practice a high level of organization. You can start with managing your reading materials and stationaries. Writing notes and a study plan, time management you can't study well or even do your assignments if you don't know how to manage time. Time is a valuable resource that can help you plan study goals and fulfill them if well managed. Plan extra time to read beyond your classwork and expound your ideas on various subjects. Read other people's content on various topics to learn how to handle various types of essays. Note how they engage their audience, deliver key points, and logically express their ideas. Develop and practice good writing skills even during lectures. You can apply this technique by writing down points you can elaborate on later. You can also draw out mind maps and expand them later. This trick will help when researching and writing any essay. Also, practice great note-taking skills. Make sure to draft your notes, rewrite, and proofread them. Comprehensive notes will be easy to review before exam time. You need this proofreading skill to write and pass your college essay. Writing techniques. The following are the writing techniques you should apply to pass college essays. 1. Understand the essay instructions. Read the instructions given in your essay carefully. Most students usually ignore to take this guideline seriously and end up failing the test. Don't assume you know what's being tested without reading the questions thoroughly and understanding. 2. Analyze the question. After understanding the question, plan what kind of answers you will give. List all the ideas that come to your mind concerning the essay. You can break them down into sections or list them. Again, Draw a roadmap of how you dissect the whole essay. 3. Budget your time, as we stated in studying techniques. Time management greatly influences your learning and passing in college. At this stage, plan your time on how you will answer the essay question. Your time should include research, outlining, writing, and proofreading stages. 4. Research thoroughly, refrain from relying on your knowledge, Gather more content and facts from reliable online sources. To find out what others think about the topic, read some samples online on the same subjects. 5. Organize your thoughts. After gathering content, it's time to phrase your answer. Ensure you organize your ideas in a short outline before writing the essay. Write down the key points you feel when you read. They will trigger your memory and help you expand further. Six. Be concise, as you write, ensure you get to the point. Essays usually have a word count limit, and you don't want to reach the word limit with unnecessary information. So, let your focus be on the quality instead of the word count. Ensure your essay answers the question thoroughly and concisely. Don't dwell so much on a lengthy introduction and conclusion. The essay's answer lies in the body, where you should concentrate. Let your statements have statistical facts and evidence from credible sources. These illustrations will make your essay presentable 
and provide support to your arguments. 7. Discuss each idea in a different paragraph. When writing your essay, keep the main ideas in separate paragraphs. Let the body have different paragraphs depending on the number of ideas you present. For instance, if the main ideas are four, you should have at least four paragraphs in this section. 8. Write multiple drafts. The trick to writing great essays is thorough revision. Though sometimes it's tempting to write one draft. You will find many mistakes you can correct and keep improving. After writing the first draft, we advise you to rest and come back with a fresh mind. We have always advocated for thorough proofreading, especially in our persuasive essay writing help, you realize that, after some rest, you can identify spelling mistakes, grammar, and vague statements, which helps polish your essay. You can also share with friends and let them correct you. How do you write a good quality essay outline? If you need to present a good essay for better grades, it should have a well-organized outline. Most of these outline details are well explained in the article, How to Write an Essay Outline. However, we will give you a recap on the same. A typical essay should have three sections, introduction, body, and conclusion. The introduction should have a hook and a thesis statement. The body should have key points that you will discuss. For you to write a good outline that will ultimately lead to a quality essay, you should examine what's the purpose of your essay. Is the essay informing, persuading, or inspiring the audience? The answer to this question will direct what kind of thesis you should write. Outline the introduction, write a sentence about your topic, and, later, the thesis. You can also add your essay hook, quotes, statistics, rhetorical questions, etc., Outline the body, craft a topic sentence, and list some supporting arguments or ideas. Also, develop a transition sentence to ensure you have organized thoughts as you start writing. Outline your conclusion, mention your thesis in the conclusion with different words. Make a conclusion statement on the topic. After following the above tips, it's easy to write your essay. This mind map will guide you through developing more essay content. Again, a good outline will ensure you remain focused on the essay's purpose. Note, remember that it's not a must for an outline to have complete sentences. An outline serves as a guideline for your writing process, the points that will trigger your creativity as you write. So, no one will be marking the outline, but a good outline will lead to a quality essay. Common terms in essay questions, if you can identify a question and analyze it accordingly, it's a great way to pass your essay exams. The following are the most common words you will find in your essay exams. 1. Identity You should give a short, concise answer to the question. Some other keywords to look out for include, summarize, list, define, and enumerate. It may be a partial length essay. 2. Explain the answers should be very detailed with a complete essay. Check out other keywords such as illustrate, discuss, and analyze. 3. Compare this question requires you to analyze it and focus on the similarities, differences, and connections between specific ideas. 4. Argue such an essay question needs you to form an opinion or take a position and defend it against the alternative options. Your answer should prove or justify your position with evidence from experts in the niche. 5. Assess the essay should have values, strengths, or weaknesses about an argument or topic. However, it will help if you give your opinion on the topic. 6. Trace requires you to describe something sequentially. Examples of questions you can find in college essay. 1. Should the use of plastics be prohibited in many developing countries? 2. Discuss your first experience in college or campus. 3. What is the most horrifying situation that you have ever experienced in life? 4. Parents are the best teachers. Discuss this statement. 5. Should the use of inorganic fertilizers be banned for all horticultural crops? 6. Explain doctor negligence and its consequences. 7. Why are parents very overprotective and strict? 8. Define online work. 9. 
Which are the pros and cons of perfectionism? 10. Describe your literary character in your favorite movie? 11. What is your most memorable day in school? 12. How do you learn to say no to people? 13. How to let go of hurtful things and forgive? 14. Best tips for writing an internship application? Examples of questions you can find in college essay, 1. Should the use of plastics be prohibited in many developing countries? 2. Discuss your first experience in college or campus. 3. What is the most horrifying situation that you have ever experienced in life? 4. Parents are the best teachers. Discuss this statement. 5. Should the use of inorganic fertilizers be banned for all horticultural crops? 6. Explain doctor negligence and its consequences. 7. Why are parents very overprotective and strict? 8. Define online work. 9. Which are the pros and cons of perfectionism? 10. Describe your literary character in your favorite movie. 11. What is your most memorable day in school? 12. How do you learn to say no to people? 13. How to let go of hurtful things and forgive? 14. Best tips for writing an internship application.